What's going on everybody? It's Cool Fury. Welcome back to the channel. Welcome back to another video 100 with Cool Fury, man. So this video right here is actually going to be about all of the silver that I bought from TJ Maxx. I have four different items here. I have two silver chains and two silver rings. The rings are from a company called Black Label Heritage and the chains are, are from a company called Mateo, I believe. I believe that's how you pronounce it. So, just gonna jump right into it here. I have all the jewelry right here in this box. And we'll start with the, with the rings first. Just wanna give you a little bit of an update and let you know how things are going so far. Um, I wear these things quite a bit and, you know, I have a few scratches on them and things, but no uh no missing stones and haven't uh, noticed any changes in the color so here's my square shaped ring get close on that so you can see this is a nice looking ring this thing um hits well in the sunlight looks really good and just as i say there's no stones missing. What do I notice right here? This is the first time I'm seeing this right here on camera. See that right there, you can tell there's a stone missing. I don't know when that popped out because I promise the last time I had this ring on, I did not notice a stone missing out of this thing. So this is the first time I've seen that. I'm gonna let you see that again. Right there, stone is missing. Other than that, the ring um, looks good. You know, I've got got some scratches on it. I don't know if you can really see that right here. I'm trying to do the best I can with this phone, but the thing about this phone is, it's not it's not like a nice camera. I actually got a camera on the way. I was I was hoping to film this video with the camera, but. It's still, um, it didn't ship until I think yesterday or today. So future videos are definitely gonna look better because I got a camera on the way. So I'm trying to make these videos better. But as for this ring, man, um, few scratches. And besides that stone that I just noticed missing, it actually looks pretty good. Put it on my finger real quick, let you see that. It looks good, it sparkles, it shines. Even with that stone missing, it still looks good. But now that I notice there's a stone missing, it's probably gonna bug me a little bit. I don't know, let me know in the comment section, have any of you ever um, had some, something with CZs and one popped out and you went to a jewelry store and, and um, had them put one in? I've never done any of that before. Um, I, don't, I don't know how that process works. But let me know, I mean, this ring looks nice. I wanna keep it, so probably gonna be interested in getting that stone, um, getting a stone put in there. But nice looking ring. So we're gonna move on to the second one. And this is like a curved link, Cuban link style ring right here. And this also looks good in the light. For some reason, I think this, the, um, I think the square one hits a little better. Maybe it's the setting, I don't know. But um, here's this ring. Try to give you a little bit of profile in there. Finger profile. Right here on my pinky. Let me try to give you a close up look at it. Now, I haven't noticed any stones missing on this, but let's just, let's see. Cause I didn't notice anything missing on the square ring either. And obviously there is a stone missing on that one, but don't see anything missing on this. Turning it around here, I don't see any stones missing. Still looks, still looks good. Show you what it looks like from the side. This is what it looks like on the inside. Nothing's turned colors. 
still a good looking uh, a good looking piece right here like I said I wear these rings all the time I wash my hands so these rings have seen different soaps and they've been wet they've been knocked around and they still look good so all right move on to the chains now so the last video I put up on this channel was about this chain right here this is I don't even know what the millimeter is on this I had to guess maybe eight something like that um, this is a flat um, Cuban link chain so you can see from the side right here it's flat so it's gonna be thinner on the side it's diamond cut though so when you flip it around I mean this thing catches light pretty well you can see it pretty nicely when I go outside with this thing on in the sun it shines pretty bright and I've been in the shower with this thing on um, I've been sweating with this thing on I've actually um, been asleep with it on and it's holding up fine for now I mean I don't know we'll see um, moving forward how it does but for now it's been pretty good and let you see there's the stamp right in there 925 Italy I don't even know if you can see that hold on yeah it's there right right there is a stamp this thing still looks good still shines the links probably could be a little bit tighter but I mean it's a it's still a good looking chain I still like this chain I've had this probably for a couple weeks, I guess, or around a couple weeks. Um, so it hasn't been long, but I've definitely um, been trying to put some wear and tear on it to see how it holds up. So I'm going to keep sweating in it, keep taking showers in it, and we'll see what happens. So the last thing is this. I actually never made a video on this chain. Um, basically because it's pretty much the same thing as this this chain right here but it's just a smaller one I don't know maybe like three four millimeters or something that's just my guess I, I need to get one of those things so I can actually measure it and tell you exactly how um, how wide it is but yeah just a smaller chain of the one I just uh, um, smaller version of the chain of the one I just showed you looks good had this for a few days um, shines really good when I go outside just like this one does it's just smaller I'm twisting it hold on and it looks good you know it's a good looking chain haven't noticed any changes in the color or anything like that good and again sweating um, bathing you know getting in the shower I do the same thing with this one as well so we'll see how this uh, TJ Maxx silver jewelry holds up um, everything looks good only thing is like this ring right here is missing that stone right there but that's the only thing I've noticed, man. Other than that, everything looks good. Um, this jewelry did not cost a lot to buy. Um, I think this chain might have been maybe 90 bucks. And this one was like 35. And these rings were like, what? Not this one. This is a $12, $13 stainless steel from Amazon. But this. It was like 35 or something like that 
35, 33, and this was about the same price. So didn't cost that much, man. Um, it's holding up so far, and hopefully it'll continue to do so. But if it doesn't, you can count on me making a video about it because I buy this stuff and wear it and you know review it. I want you to know exactly how it's gonna go before you decide to purchase. So if anything goes wrong, I will definitely let you know. Um, I just wanna say I appreciate everybody. I appreciate all the new subscribers. I crossed over the 200 mark. You know, I know this is a small channel, but I always say this, I appreciate every viewer I get on this channel, man. Um, I'm just trying to grow and make more videos and when my new camera shows up my canon um the video quality will definitely be getting better so shout out to everybody that's uh leaving comments likes and everything shout out to all the subscribers um tell a friend tell a friend man uh, spread the word about the channel so like i always say man watch the other videos on this channel check out my other channel where i drop my music if you care if you care to leave a like, comment here, do that, and uh, I'll catch you in the next video, man. I'm out. Peace. What? Look, Instagram fingers when they see him. Say it to my face, not an Instagram DM. What it might cause next, wouldn't want to be him. A dumb threat will get your sunset like the PM. When you go about your problems the wrong way and breathe my name in it, you gon' make it a long day. Had your fam singing, missing you with a long face. All because you threatening to spit in the wrong face. People talk loud till you see them in the public. Stand on what you say, the consequences, what you stuck with. Catch me on the off night, you know you lost, right? My gun barrel started smoking like exhaust pipes. Now your family dressing off white. When they bury you, bet you never thought that's what it cost, right? Talk and stay talk. And really go nowhere so leave it where it is nigga you don't want to go there grind for my pay to 